Good evening, Chris Blyfers. Welcome to your review for today. Now, <clears throat> some weeks ago, I reviewed the Pringles Sizzling Cheese and Chili Flavor Crisps, and I rather liked them. So when I saw this in the shop today, I couldn't resist but buy it. This is the Pringles Sizzling X. Extra hot cheese and chili flavor. And um, now I know I can see that Tigger is really excited about these. He likes his fiery crisps. Let's hope that these will live up to the billing. This is a 180 gram bag pack. And just be really careful there, folks, because this is exactly the same size can as the regular Pringles flavors, but they are 200 grams. So they're trying to pull the wool over our eyes here. It's really a bit cheeky and I'm not a fan. Um, you know, if it's only 180 grams, well then you should make it and put it in a slightly smaller pack. That would be better for the environment and it would be a bit more honest with us. Nevertheless, Let's have a pop into here, <clears throat> open these up and yeah, I mean you can see that there's been a bit of settling there when you get the sour cream and onion, Pringles for example, it's full right to the brim. But here we've, we've lost 20 grams of crisps, bit cheeky. Anyway, without further ado, let's crack and have a look at these. So, there are the crisps. They look like Pringles. Everything about them says Pringles. I just wonder how extra hot they really are. Let's taste. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Well, mostly good news, I think. These are the regular Pringles crunch, not the crunchiest of crisp, but it's just a terrific shape. Uh, and that brings the score up to a three out of five. Um for the flavor of the potato, for a reconstituted and formed crisp. It's not bad, it's a three out of five. Flavor wise, definitely I taste the cheese and then the chili comes afterwards. Is it extra hot? Are you gonna be hanging your tongue out and searching for yogurt or cold water or an ice cube? No, you're not. But it's quite a long lasting heat. It's a good 30 seconds since I finished my third crisp and I can still feel a little bit of the buzz of the chili. And that long lastingness is to be lauded. So I think flavor wise, I think it's quite good. I'm going to give it a four out of five. Munchability, we all know that Pringles are off the charts when it comes to munchability. Unless I particularly disliked the flavour, I don't see that I can give it anything else except a five. In terms of value, I did pick these up on sale at a rather strange price of £1.65. <clears throat> it's not great value, but it's not bad value either. Uh, I'll give that a three out of five. Overall, this is a good crisp and the sum of Pringles is always greater than... Um, just the constituent parts. So I'm going to give this a four out of five. I like this sizzling range. It's pretty good. There's some extra options for us Pringles fans. And I recommend it. Four stars. Keep up the good work, Pringles.